Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Courtney here. Two things. You will see my face this week in all the videos because people on YouTube are stealing content, okay, and posting it on their YouTube, which not a big deal. It just, it is what it is. We've had this issue off and on for a few years, right? So there's that. Um, second, I am not reading stories, okay? I'm done with the stories. People don't want to step out of their own story. I want to step out of it for you, okay? So you're going to get the basic. And I will elaborate a little more over on Patreon, okay? So there's that. <clears throat> I am going to start with Taurus. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. We are week three, right? Yes, we are. We are. We are. Isn't that a song? We are, we are. Hmm. All right. So, want to start with Taurus? Week three, Taurus. One more for Taurus. Eighteen and older. Okay. This is um sexual tarot. <clears throat> Come through with the magic. You know I'm gonna try to get you. Taurus, 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 Taurus. Nine of Swords, Justice, Five of Cups, Six of Pence, King of Wands, The Empress. Nine of Swords, Justice, Five of Cups, Six of Pence, King of Wands, Empress. I feel like some of you are waiting on someone to approach you. You know somebody's watching. You know somebody's looking. You're waiting for justice. You're waiting to be in someone's arms. Um... I will tell you if you have any sexual encounters this week, you might be a little nervous or hesitant. You have the the major arcana and the minor arcana for justice, for balance, for synergy. You do have... There could be a woman here watching you. Or this is you waiting to kind of be nurtured. See, the thing is, the Empress just doesn't wait around like that. You notice how she's just kind of sitting and chilling. Could be dealing with a Libra. Taurus, by a sign. If there's two people in your life, be careful, okay? Because one is a better suitor. Because you have an energy here of seduction. Sexual seduction. And then you have another energy over here that it's not really sexual seduction. It's like being in somebody's arms, being comforted, feeling good. So there could be a masculine here that's kind of like on the outskirts. Wanting this, upset. Someone feels like they missed an opportunity somewhere. 
I also see probably there's going to be <clears throat> a little bit of jealousy here. Someone clearly needs to say something too. There is a little bit of jealousy here. I think it's more fear of somebody stepping in before somebody else does. Just be wary. Be cautious. Really, be cautious who you're hanging out with, who who you're being intimate with is, is the message I'm getting. Again, you do have a woman here, and can be masculine too, right? That is really watching over you, is really watching this masculine. I don't know if she's trying seduction. I don't really feel like she is. I feel like she's part of, or he is part of someone's past. There will be balance, guys. There is balance. You, you might be coming together with someone. But again, this someone could just be nervous to approach you. You could be a little intimidating. I would try not to worry about this other energy, male or female. Again, you do have a masculine. I, I think more or less they could be looking at you as an empress and they're pretty upset about how something went down. Okay, so some of you, you are dealing with someone from your past. There is some regret here. And it's like the waiting. Well, I don't see waiting, but I, I don't see action either. I see a little hesitation, I see anxiety, I see stress. This is somebody who definitely wants to balance the scales. I don't know if someone gave too much attention to one person versus the other because there, there clearly was no balance. There is now though, okay? There is balance, there is justice, there is something going in your favor, there is a right decision, there is a fair decision, there's a just decision, there is a masculine if you are dealing with a masculine, I am telling you, they do want to just hold you. So I don't know if they have regret. Because this is actually two different women. So I don't know, again, if this is somebody on the outskirts, maybe your mother, the monarchy, somebody, um, a friend, a sister, just, you know, somebody who is above, okay, not above you like that, but within the family or the friendship, somebody who, who plays mom, you know, um, is not going to like it. But there is balance. At the end of the day, you guys are getting something you want. You do seem a little nervous, apprehensive, or this is them, okay? Um, I don't really think you need to worry about whatever this energy is, please. Yeah, Six of Swords. So the Empress is kind of moving forward. Learning, picking up on something. Knight of Cups. All right, so this is more or less somebody probably looking at you. I don't think they're trying to, well, no. There's something, hmm, I really want to say they're looking at you like this, but but they're not. Because this is kind of like reddish hair, reddish hair, blonde hair, reddish, okay. This is somebody that might try to be seductive. Or this is somebody that is moving on. It, it's almost like they tried, but they did not succeed. Okay. 
so I'm not really sure what that message, who that message is for. It looks like this energy is going to move towards something new. This, I mean, I mean, this is definitely an energy. If this isn't you and that's the way they're looking at you, this is definitely someone else watching something else go down. But I, I really, honestly, I wouldn't worry about it. It doesn't seem like you need to really worry about it. Spirit might send somebody their way to kind of distract them. Because there's a, there was a, obviously a lot of things that were unfair in a situation here. One was getting more than the other, you know, that type of energy. So, but things are coming into play. Things are coming into balance. All right, so I'm going to read you guys a, a animal spirit card. And what I'm going to do, Taurus, please. What I'm going to do is, um, ooh, you got the elephant. I'm just going to read the positive and negative of it. I'm not really going to... Um, Read the whole thing, I'll give my opinion, okay? Sexual seduction. Okay, so be careful. What? Anyhow, when things are in balance, you're focused, you're generous, and you're loving, okay? Taurus, when things are out of balance, you're misunderstood, okay? And it's, okay, whoa, it's misunderstood fate, so something's faded here. So like I said, the justice is coming. Have you been waiting on it? It's coming. So if this is misunderstood fate, there's obviously miscommunication. We know there's a lot going on. Okay. So I, I do see... I mean, you guys could be the empress here, but if you are the empress, you moved away from this energy because you want some type of emotional connection, not sexual seduction. I don't know if you started off with friends with benefits here because there's a lot of sexual seduction here, guys. Okay. So at the end of the day, Something is coming into, the right moves will be made. It, it's like justice going in your favor. Okay, so when you're in balance, you're on point, focused, generous, and loving. That would make sense. The Empress is all those. Okay. So something is coming in your direction. And when you add a balance, like I said, it's misunderstood fate. Unstoppable wise. It represents immense wisdom and good fortune. It is said that the great elephant is a destroyer of obstacles. So you're going to get through any obstacle. As I said, I wasn't going to read it for you. To add to the mystery, the elephant is known as the create, to create obstacles in order to steer us in the right direction. Trust this gentle and noble creature. It eliminates the way, it eliminates the way with light of self-knowledge. Okay. So we do have two different stories here. If there is other people involved, there's a nosy Nelly, that type of stuff, don't worry about it. It's, it would be X'd out, okay? Obstacles are being cleared. So others of you, this is them. You're the Empress. You're looking like the Empress. You are the Empress. You move forward from this situation. You don't hold on to the past. You know your worth, okay? Something is going in your favor. You do have somebody coming at you right around the corner or somebody that came at you, but it to me, it probably wasn't enough for you because it's under the Five of Cups, okay? So I will um, get into this a little more over on Patreon. I hope you guys have a kick-ass week. Bye, guys.